Greetings, yogis. Welcome to another yoga, stretching, qigong sort of flow practice. Uh, Elizabeth Scali here, your facilitator from Living Sublimely Well. Thanks for tuning in to another video. We're going to do a modified set of sun salutations. I'm going to walk us through the first round slowly and really speaking about each of the postures as we're in them. And then we'll do several rounds more vigorously uh, to really just flow through that sun salute. And then afterwards, we'll close up with a fun, energizing, lively breathing practice to send you off. So just a warning, uh, this particular practice I wouldn't do in an evening time before bed, or if you're a night shift worker, alternatively in the day. Uh, if you are settling down and going to rest and preparing for quality sleep, this is not the practice to do before that. This is more of an energizing, uplifting, start the day, have that energy through the day type practice. If you're under the care of any medical professionals, honor any restrictions they've placed upon you. And obviously, first and foremost, honor the self. You know your body. You can feel the physical body as you're moving through the practice. If anything uh, initiates a sharp shooting pain, if you get dizzy or lightheaded, or if you just want to stop, just stop. All right, so as I said, I'm going to walk you slowly through what we're going to be doing, and then we will go through several rounds of this modified sun salute. I'm going to take just a step back so you can kind of see more of the body, but just know I'm here for you. Any comments or questions, place those below. All right, so you wanna to come to an easy standing posture. Your feet are hip width distance apart. There is a slight bend in those knees, so keeping them unlocked, keeping them loose. In fact, before we get right into the sun salute, let's just flow through some willow trees. So just bend one knee and then the other knee, allow the hip to turn, and then the arms are just sort of collateral, um, byproducts of the hip movements. We're not necessarily moving our arms and shoulders. We're flowing from the lower part of our torso, the hips, and bending at those knees. And with the hip turns, the upper body sort of gets involved. So just waking up the spine, loosening up the back muscles, warming up our hips, and getting ready for our modified sun salute. All right, bringing this to stillness. As I said, our feet are hip width distance apart. I'm gonna be turning in different angles so that you can see my back and posture. You can just stay in the way that you are. So feet are um, hip width distance apart, slight bend in those knees. Let's bring our arms to our sides with the palms facing forward. Go ahead and inhale the shoulders up and then drop the shoulders down the back. No need for those shoulders to be lifted. Let them relax. All right, so this is mountain posture, standing strong and steady, firm in our mountain pose. Beautiful. So with our inhale, taking the palms facing up, hands overhead, and with the exhale, the palms move away from each other, lead with the chest, flat back, all the way down into a forward fold. Now, as I said, we're gonna kinda go slow, so hang out here for a moment, you can bring your hands to your mat, to your shins, or you can grab opposite elbows with opposite hands. Let the head hang heavy, so nod the head yes, and perhaps shake the head no, left to right. Really let the crown of the head pull towards the mat, so release the neck. No strain on the neck here. This is forward fold, very good. All right, inhale, take the hands to the shins, Lift the head, your gaze is down to the mat, lift the shoulders, you're coming to what's called a flat back, okay? Exhale down into forward fold. We'll do that one more time. Inhale the hands to the shins, lift the shoulders, looking down at your mat with a flat back. Excellent, exhale down. Now take the hands and with your inhale, swoop the hands wide, lift the chest, reverse that swan dive, Palms come touching overhead, exhale the hands to heart center. All right, so we're gonna move through this modified sun salute with a little bit 
a little bit more vigor, a little bit more active energy, and really flowing from one posture to the next. So just listen to the cues and keep that body flowing. Excellent. Inhale the hands up overhead, gazing up, slight back bend. Exhale the palms away from each other, lead with the chest, flat back, forward fold. Inhale, take the hands to the shins, lift the head and shoulders, gazes down, flat back. Exhale into the forward fold. Inhale, swoop the arms away from each other, lifting up, looking up to the hands, exhaling the hands to heart center. One more time. Inhale the hands looking up, exhale the palms away from each other, leading with the chest, flat back, swan dive down into forward fold. Inhale, hands come to shins, lift the shoulders, look down, flat back. Exhale, back into your forward fold. Inhale, swoop the hands up, palms come together, looking up, exhaling the hands to heart center. Here we go. Inhale the hands up, Looking up, slight back bend. Exhale the hands away from each other. Lead with the chest, swan dive into a forward fold. Inhale, the hands come to the shins. Lift the shoulders, flat back. Exhale into forward fold. Inhale, swoop the hands away from each other. Reverse that swan dive, palms touch. Exhaling to heart center. Let's keep going. Inhale, the hands up, looking up. Exhale the palms away from each other, lead with the chest, swan dive into a forward fold. Inhale, hands come to the shins, flat back. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, swooping up, hands come overhead. Exhale the palms to heart center. Keep it moving. Inhale the hands up, looking up. Exhaling, forward fold. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, swooping up. Hands come overhead. Exhale to heart center. You're doing great, yogis. Inhale, hands up, looking up. Exhale, palms away from each other. Lead with the chest, swan dive forward. Inhale, hands come to shins, flat back. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, swooping those arms outwards and up. Exhaling the heart center. Two more times. Inhale the arms up, looking up. Exhaling forward fold. Inhale the hands to the shins, coming to flat back. Exhaling forward fold. Inhale, swooping up, lift up, look up. Exhale those hands to heart center. Last time. Inhale the hands up, look up. Exhale, palms float away from each other, lead with the chest, swan dive, forward fold. Inhale, hands to shins, lift up to a flat back. Exhale to a forward fold. Inhale, swooping up, gaze towards those hands. Exhale, hands to heart center. Let's bring our hands down at our sides, palms face forward, relax the shoulders, tuck the tail. Feet are hip width distance apart with that slight bend in the knee. Close the eyes, mountain pose. Notice the body. Experience the breathing. Observe the heart beating in the chest. Feeling the heat. Experiencing the energy. Wonderful job, yogis, blinking our eyes open. And as I said, we're gonna close up with a really fun, invigorating breath practice. So if anyone knew me in my previous career, sometimes when the meetings would get heavy and the energy would get tough, tense, or stressful, we would take a break and I would come back and lead this breathing exercise to get us moving again. So I'm excited to share with you the breath of joy. If you have done the breath of joy before, uh, you know what we're about to do. If not, I'm gonna explain it to you first, and then as with the modified sun salutes, we'll go through a couple rounds together. So make sure your nostrils are clear. You can breathe in and out of the nose. Uh, if you need a tissue, go ahead and grab that. But what we're gonna do, you're gonna take 
three sniffs to inhale with three arm movements. So it'll be inhale the arms up and forward, inhale the arms out to the sides, inhale the arms all the way up and forward, and then when we exhale, we're gonna drop our arms, we're gonna drop the top half of our body, and we're gonna exhale out of our mouth with a sigh, a sound, a ha. Really exhale with force, with vigor, getting that stagnant energy, getting that stagnant air, that stagnant tension, just all of that gunk out of the body. Okay, so it's going to look and sound, again, I'm gonna do it slowly, something like this, and then we'll move quickly, all right? So it's inhale, 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 exhale, dropping, ha! So, ha! Okay, so three sniffs to inhale, and then one big exhale with a sound, a sigh, a ha! Getting that energy out, all right? As I said, you just stay feet hip width distance apart, one direction. I'm going to do the same and kind of turn as I'm doing it so you can see different angles for the video. All right, breath of joy, here we go. Ha! 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 Two more times. Ha! Ha! Come on up, back to mountain posture. Palms are forward, shoulders are relaxed. Tuck the tail, slight bend in your knees. Feet hip width distance apart. You can keep the eyes open or if you feel safe and comfortable to do so, blinking the eyes closed. Again, observe the physical body. I'm aware of the breath. Noticing the heartbeat. Feeling that energy. The tingling, warmth and heat throughout the body, mind and spirit. Beautiful. Deep inhale through the nose. Exhaling out of the mouth with a sigh. <sighs> Go ahead and blink the eyes open, bringing hands to heart center. It has been a true joy, a pleasure, and such an honor to practice these healing routines with you in this way. Take care of body, mind, and spirit throughout the rest of your day. Let's drop our arms, inhaling our arms, hands overhead. Palms come to heart center on the exhale. Namaste, friends. Thank you. All right, everyone. Thank you again for another fun practice. If you've enjoyed this, just letting you know, we are starting a new season of upcoming yoga classes at the Living Sublimely Well Yoga Studio in Maryland. So if you're in the Hereford zone, which is in Baltimore County, so if you are, you'll know, uh, that's kind of your distance for where the studio is. I'll leave the link to the yoga class registration page in the comments below. So go ahead and take a look at that take a look at that and if you're interested let me know pretty quickly uh, classes fill up fast and we only have a limited amount of space because I like to keep a really intimate and personal feel in the classes all right everyone until next time take care be well thank you